And the primary purpose, you've got one board for kind of managing all the actuators mm -hmm. and then another board for the temperature sensors. Hey, it's Aim with IP Exchange at Embedded World 2024. I'm here with Keith from Arduino on the Arduino booth. And there's another kit to do with the Opta. So, Keith, if you'd first like to just remind our audience what the Opta is and then explain what we've got here. Yes, definitely. Thank you for this. Um, the Arduino Opta was actually developed in partnership with Finder. Mm -hmm. So a company kind of renowned for the, in the PLC market. And we, we brought it, introduced it last year. Um, it was really surprising the level of takeoff, the mm. level of interest. And the whole purpose was to try and open up the PLC market. Obviously, it's very restricted, yeah. particular pieces of software, particular hardware. And we just wanted to take a new approach to this, um, which has gone down very, very well. Mm. And having had the initial kind of people using it in industry, mm. we started getting questions or could we provide some form of training? Okay. So both at a professional level, with um, people want to train their staff and their employees on how to use a micro PLC, but also at a university level in particular, where they want to associate the education they're doing with actual industrial applications. Mm, cool. And this is where the kind of the idea for the um, PLC starter kit came together. So you've got the, the core opta at the heart mm -hmm. of it and then a couple of other boards and I'd say the main kind of concept behind it is all of the content that comes with it. Mm -hmm. So there's a, there's a full course and a number of projects okay. that students can follow. So excellent. Um, so I can see there's two new boards here which I don't think I've seen before so are they exclusive to the, the kits? Yes, yeah, they come uh, come uh, complementary with the kit. Mm -hmm. We don't sell them, that, sell them separately. Mm -hmm. And the primary purpose, you've got one board for kind of managing all the actuators mm -hmm. and then another board for the temperature sensors. Nice. And in terms of um, kind of the, obviously PLCs are using it in, in industry and the whole point of the Arduino Pro line is you've got industrial grade Arduinos. but. Um, what kind of typical applications do you see um, these kind of devices used in? Well, we've had a, a number, and one of the most kind of exciting examples, it was actually used um, for the Stratford Festival Theatre. Oh, to what? actually what? manage, it was involved with managing, um, if you think of how a theatre and you've got the floors and people have to yeah, yeah, yeah. from below and that moving around, mm. We had a, an opta involved wow. in that over in the US. So, yeah, that's we've seen some great use cases. Cool. And yeah. in, in terms of the software suite, because um, I'm guessing that's slightly different to the usual IDE with, um, the, with the PLC programming so, languages Yeah, and so stuff. we've got, a, there's actually an yeah. Arduino PLC IDE okay. that's now available. So we launched that to go with the opta last year. Cool. And then you've got a whole choice of other um, kind of the standard PLC languages that you can use alternatively. Nice. So if you're training with this, then you you have the opportunity to train in all the languages that you'd need to use when you go into the job. Exactly. Yes. Cool. So you can either carry on using Arduino, which you we hope they know and love, mm. or they can use whichever one is specific to their end employee. Nice. Cool. And I believe there's another expansion to the Opta series, which we'll talk out about in another video. Yeah, but, definitely. Yeah, yeah but um, yeah, I'll do a write up and come and uh, if you're looking to train in PLCs, Arduino's got you covered. Are you where my engineers at?